All right, so I've been really excited about this. This is the Ryobi Easy Clean 18 volt 320 PSI power cleaner. All right, so they're saying it's five times more powerful than a garden hose. Really good for, you know, cleaning my mowers under the deck and stuff. And we're gonna see what else you can do. Good for, you know, when you're washing your car. Maybe you got some mud on there. You want to kind of get off. All right. You get a nice little. This is your 20 foot hose. This is a much better design. I forget what company had one of these. I think it was Works. And it's definitely a heavier unit, but you have a nice protective um, battery cage here. All right, so this is all sealed with a with weather sealant. Okay, to keep that water away from the battery and the internal components here. Real nice touch. Um, I actually got this for seventy nine dollars with two three amp hour batteries. Okay. Um, Part of Ryobi days, this was one of the tools. Actually, it was 99 I apologize. $99 with two threes and that compact charger. All right, so very lightweight, but it is a little bit bigger than that works model. All right, but I think we're going to get... I was very unimpressed with that works um, power cleaner. But let's see how sh this one does. All right, so I like the way this is set up too. All right, so what you do, snaps in. All right, when you want to release this, there's a button right here. Press this in, pull out. I like that. Really, really simple. All right, and then on this part, you're going to screw this part in. And you're all ready to rock. Within 10 seconds, you're ready to start power cleaning. But we're gonna try it first without a hose. All right, and very lightweight. Again, I don't have a battery attached to it, but definitely one hand operation. You got some nice rubber over molds here um, to protect it if you're gonna lay it down and whatnot. But, you know, if you're cleaning your car and the asphalt, you know, to keep it staying nice and clean. All right, so we're gonna set this up be right back. All right, so like I said, we're going to use it without the hose first. You got this nice little dauber, all right, for all you fishermen. So this is going to, you know, sit in your five-gallon bucket or in your local pond or lake, all right, to get that water um, to insert it, obviously, into your easy cleaner to be forced out with force as a power cleaner or pressure washer. Well, there we have it. All right, so this is going to get set up. Um, yeah, same way. So this is where you would put your hose, and this is where you're going to put your little, you know, water attachment. All right, so you don't have to use a hose. Maybe you want to use your pool water, whatever. All right, you're going to set it up same way. Probably just press down here. Let go. Wow, really simple operation, guys. All right, we're going to set this up. Be right back. Oh. All right, so I got like a one-gallon bucket here. All right, what we're going to do is we'll put her right here. Actually, let's bring her up. I'm losing water. All right, we're going to put in or little dauber there and I gotta grab a battery we'll be right back all right so we got our battery uh, this has a three-in-one nozzle on it so you have a little bit of um, versatility with how much PSI you want to blast out of this thing all right turbo and to move it, 
15 degree rinse and again turbo really impressed with just how easy this is to work um, literally out of the box within 30 seconds you're ready to rock all right so we got our opening our water attachment or our water taker attachment with the dauber that's in there so this should be ready to rock all right you do got it looks like a safety here that you're going to be able to press on you don't have to keep it pressed in which is good all right let's see now this is my makita it's a mess i had to pull some of it out um and it stinks to high hell so this actually smells like dog crap all right i couldn't get it out by hand all of it it's just really caked on there all right we're gonna see how this sucker does working its way through the hose I mean, look how much I did, guys. Over here, show them the water. I'm not, you'd be surprised um, how much, you know, if you have a five gallon bucket, which I, which I should be using, but this is just a little one gallon, and I barely taken any of the water out, as you can see. So, let's get back to this. I almost lost my photographer. All right, as you can see, can we see up here? I'm gonna clean this all out with this sucker. We'll see how she does. All right, let's go, let's rock. Let's go right up here, can you, can you, can you get this area? No, no, yep, like, I'm pretty impressed, guys. You know, it doesn't feel like it's doing a lot, but, you know, 320 PSI, that's what they're saying. And I think it's definitely doing that. Here, let's see if we can get this caked off. See it over here? You can zoom in. And I still got a lot of water left. All right, let's do this area. Here, come on this side. Keep coming. Okay. Step over to the thing. Excellent. Get this area right here. Splash cam. Splash cam.
I like this, guys. If you have a five gallon bucket, you're gonna be able to use this thing for, you know, three or four mowers, no doubt. And it's great, guys, for another reason is you don't have to go that worry about, you know, stripping the paint off whatever you're doing, the decks, um, you know, well, not stripping the paint. Oh, yeah, off your off your mower decks. Maybe you're using it for your zero turns. You know, you got enough power, but it's not overwhelming. Obviously, you can see this, this deck pretty much, you know, spick and spam. Let's move this over. And I just want to see if we can clean my... We'll break it. Yeah. You pause it? All right, now, you're probably going to need a, more of a pressure washer for something like this. Probably maybe even with a little bit of cleaner right some clorox outdoor but let's see if we can kind of get some of this clean and i'm all out of water right, let me see Get over. I mean, if you spray some Clorox outdoor on this and let it sit for like, you know, 10, 15 minutes, I think this would actually do a pretty good job. I'm just really impressed with the feature that you don't need a hose with this. Because with my works, um, the works one like this, the works uh, power cleaner, it did not grab the water as well as this Ryobi does. I mean, I'm almost down to the bottom. And usually once you kind of get to that point, um, it starts having a hard time grabbing the water. But um, this one's really, really awesome. Right, let me just do this one part here. Let's see what we can do. Thing is still shooting out water like i said guys if you would have um used clorox outdoor just sprayed it on here you know get a little hand sprayer i think this would have been a lot better and it did pretty good i mean it actually shocked me again this is only 320 psi all right um this is what the rinse would look like All right, and this is what your 15 degree would be like. Not a 15 degree. I'm just about out of water now. But, I mean, you could you'll, you could see how much a gallon of water, you know, cleaned out my entire mower deck, and you know, almost, you know, cleaned this up a little bit. I mean, it did a pretty good job. Again, with no type of cleaner at all. Let me see, I'm going to put her on turbo again. Yeah, I'm all out. I mean, if you see, it, it took it pretty much down to, to the bottom there. All right, guys, so i um, been getting a lot of questions about this only because I've been talking about it, and I actually told you guys I was buying this back when Ryobi's day, back when Ryobi days was running. But, guys, for $99 with two threes, and a charger and a bag. This is a great little tool to have around. And this is where Ryobi shines, guys, is with these alternative, you know, accessory type tools. Um, you know, just a great tool to have around the house for the DIY or where you don't have to hook up, you know, uh, a gas pressure washer or even kind of get those electric ones where you kind of have to plug it into the wall uh, then run a hose, just get a, a five gallon bucket, fill up with water, and you're ready to start cleaning. So the Ryobi Easy Clean. I don't know what the price is or the deal is on this now. Again, this was during Ryobi days, $99, two threes, 
Actually, it might have been two fours this year. I think it was two fours. Excuse me. Two fours, a charger, and a bag. $99. Again, you can sell those batteries and the charger for 100 bucks and get this for free. Pretty much. Now, obviously, YOB Days has ended. I think this normally retails, I want to say $79.99. But for $79.99, this is a great tool if you're in Ryobi's platform. Obviously, the battery cage here, um, you can, you know, put in that big 9 amp hour battery. Not that you would want to, though, because it would make this a lot heavier. And this is just a 1.3. And I probably still have, I have two bars left. So... It does actually use a lot of um, battery power. Because what? I did one gallon and I took two bars off this battery. And this was fully charged. So this will <laughs> eat through batteries if you're going to use it for you know, a longer period of time. But that's it, folks. The Ryobi 18-volt Easy Clean Power Cleaner. Peace. Also, guys, you might want to use one of those HP batteries, all right? Um, you know, this is a 1.5, so I'm not saying it's going to make a hell of a lot of difference, but you might notice a couple more PSI, maybe 5, 10, 15 tops with one of, um, you know, HP batteries, right? The 3 or the 6, or if you have that 21700 cell, uh, Ryobi 3 amp hour battery, you know, you might get a couple more PSI out of it or something, but I did use the lowest battery um, with it, so take that into, um, keep that in the back of your head too. Again, very, very impressed, and, and I love when these Ryobi tools surprise me with their performance, and I, I knew I was going to like it, because it's such a great idea, uh, even though works, their kind of power cleaner I was not impressed with it at all, but this Ryobi is an awesome little um, power cleaner. Great little tool. Peace.